welcome back. Happy Halloween! I'm so excited that I'm able to get this video out on Halloween. I was a little worried that I wasn't going to be able to get it edited and up on Halloween. But today I am doing a video on a slit throat. Easy with a little bit of mortician's wax or with a little scar wax and latex laid on it. Then with some makeup and blood. Here we go. This is the final product. If you want to see how it's done, then just keep on watching and I'm going to show you how to do it right now. So what I'm going to be using today is essentially mortician's wax. It is uh, a scar wax. You can also use scar wax from the effect shop. But this is something that um, they use in the mortuaries to fill in gaps if somebody's in a car accident or something like that. And it actually smells like cinnamon. It's really weird. So I'm going to start building this up and shaping it into a slit throat type cut and just keeping it thick on the inside and kind of trying to thin it out on the outside edges. And as you can kind of see here, I'm trying to build it up on the inside of the slit just so that it looks like skin is kind of lifting up and then smoothing it out on the outside edge. And here I'm going back in and blending it and smoothing it all out just so it looks like a natural transition of skin. And once I feel like I have the wax edges nice and smooth, I'm going to go in with my liquid latex and kind of seal everything up. I'm going to pour this in a cup and I'm going to do three layers of liquid latex, drying each layer in between. And here I'm going in with my second layer of latex. I didn't want to bore you with the third layer, but I did do a third layer. Then I'm going in with the Kryolan translucent powder, and I'm just going to powder it up so it's not too sticky when I'm applying the makeup. Here I'm going in with a bright red cream, and I'm just going to put this as a base color for that cut. And here I'm taking a cream foundation to put on the edges of the cut just to kind of blend it into my skin. And here I'm going in with this deep blood red color and I'm going to deepen up the slit just to kind of give it some depth. Next, I'm going in with a cream black and I'm just going to put it into certain spots here just to kind of make it look very deep. The parts that have the black are going to deepen it up even more. 
And then for one of my favorite products, we're going in with some scab blood. This here just gives it a very realistic cut look. It's a very thick blood and it just looks realistic when you put this stuff on because it, it's what a cut would look like. Then I'm just gonna finish it off with tapping my finger and kind of blending it out just to give it that look. All right guys, that's it. That is the slit throw all finished and pretty easy. I mean, it wasn't too hard, just a little bit of wax. The wax is the hardest part to work with. Throw some latex on there, a little paint and blood, and you got yourself a slit throat that you can pretty much add to any costume. So I hope that you guys liked it. Give it a thumbs up if you did, and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!